the sunshine of the south coast, the optimism of the Aston Villa supporters ahead of the 2015-2016 season. It kicks off here. A host of new signings. Let's hope for a good campaign. We've been gauging the opinions of the fans, the people who really matter at Aston Villa. OK, fellas, the glorious sunshine of opening day. How do we feel about the new season? Yeah, I'm, I'm really excited for it. Hopefully uh, we'll get three points today and start the season off well. Yeah, Interesting signings. It's been a busy summer. Who do you think could be the surprise package who, who could really uh, stand out, Colin? The one that excites me is the lad from Blackburn. This, to score 20 goals in the Championship, that's... That's it's something. Yeah, yeah, it is, yeah definitely. Yeah. Sure. If he can transfer that to the Premiership, and there's no reason he shouldn't, mm. then I think we, you know, we should do all right. A lot of these French lads are unknown quantities, and I've had friends say to us, we could do an Arsenal, we could do a Newcastle. So, time will tell. Well, it's got to be better than the last few seasons, Jack, hasn't it? And um, I think with the signings we've made, I think we've got to be optimistic. You know, there's a nice, there's a fresh yeah. buzz about the team, and uh, some, I think some great signings. Yeah. You know, looking forward to seeing... AU and the, th the three Jordans, shall we yeah, say? That's right. You yeah, know, they're yeah. looking they're looking sharp, and uh, and he's he's consolidated the team now. And I think with Micah Richards as captain, as Tim said, you know, he's yeah. a winner, and we need somebody to to lead from the front, really. Yeah, I so, think. So uh, Richards a good a good leader, do you think? De yeah, definitely. Who could be the other standout players? Do you reckon this year? Jordan Ayew, I think. Ayew. Yeah, yeah, I think he'll score a few goals. Yeah. At what are your thoughts on the season generally then? Well, hopefully, obviously improvement on last year, new signings, hopefully they bed in well. Um, Mid-table finish, hopefully, maybe a good cut run like last year, and uh, another Wembley appearance would be nice, yeah. yeah. yeah who, who is the player you're most looking forward to seeing, and who can make the most impact, do you think, of the new guys? Um, Jordan Amavi, we watched him in the pre-season matches, he was brilliant, so, um, yeah. and hopefully uh, Jordan Ayew as well, he's... Looks good, so yeah, good, good few signings. Yeah, he's quick, isn't he? Yeah. Amavi down that left side. Yeah, yeah. So yeah, Amavi looks a good player, doesn't he? Yeah. He's a good quality player. So yeah. hopefully. And how about the, the guys who are already here, who are already out at the club? Um, I mean, Kieran Clark signed a new contract, yeah. so hopefully he'll step up to be a bit of a senior role this year and improve our defence. Yeah. Yep. Yeah, Ashley Westwood as well. I mean, hopefully he'll take a bit of more of a leading role this year in midfield, um, and obviously Gabby as well club captain you want him to sort of step up a bit more and yeah. sort of produce the performances really yeah opening day excited about the new season yeah i can't wait to be honest just the new look players and see how they get on I know we've got uh, ray wilkins in yeah. as assistant to tim sherwood a host of new signings it's been a busy summer do you think they can gel and do well for the club this year might need a few weeks to gel but yeah. after that i think they'll be all right yeah, yeah. where do you think villa can finish this season it's a tough question. Yeah, tough I question. Be nice to finish <laughs> yeah. 10th or around there, yeah, but yeah, so better than that. But these players are good quality, meant to be being bought in, so yeah, yeah. hopefully above the relegation zone. Yeah. Where do you think we can finish this season? What's realistic? Just go along the line. Eight. Well, it's an unknown quantity. Yeah. On face value, I think I was satisfied with the point. Okay. Truly. Okay. But there and, and how about a general finish for the season? Where do you think Villa can, can end up? I wouldn't That's like to venture. Okay. Top half, no? Perhaps. Right. It would be Perhaps. Nice. If, 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 these, if these lads all gel and we can get into the top half, that, that, I think that's consolidation and that's what we've got to look for at the moment. Yeah. Okay. After five years in the wilderness, yeah, you know, because yeah, yeah, that, right. that's yeah. what it has been. Yeah, it has, yeah. No yeah. two ways. Okay. Well, I want to settle for anything better than second. Second? <laughs> yeah, it's got to be oh, second. Right. <laughs> that really is possible. No, yeah. as long as we avoid relegation. Yeah. Oh, oh, I guess I'll be happy. Have you guys all come from Birmingham? Have you come from yeah. far? Yeah, yeah. yeah. Going to all the away games? Yeah, we're going to most of the away games yeah, this season. Yeah, yeah. Looking forward to it. It's, it's brilliant. The, the away support for this club. I mean, ju just describe what it's like when you're in the stand with, with the fans. Oh, it's, it's fantastic. I mean, we're, we're, we're sort of privileged few today, really, aren't we? There's about 1,500 of us. Oh, well, yeah, exactly. It's and, um, yeah, I mean, we're, we're seasoned campaigners. We've been all over, you know. And, and, I mean, the great thing about Villa is you never know what to expect. Yeah.